Today, I'm challenging the VAT-19 crew to the ultimate game of hide-and-seek, but every person I find will get shocked with the shock ball. I'm ready to shock. I hope you guys are ready to hide, because your five minutes starts now. Go! Go! Get that door open, Brandon. You're wasting time. Come on! Come on. I'm the only one who carries peas around here. As an added challenge, players will have to hide with the Hug Me Piggy, a squeezable swine that, when compressed, <laughs> makes a hilarious noise. Players will have to squeeze the pig throughout the game regardless of how close I am. I want that home! I want those chickens home. too. I'm going with the blue, the blue chicken! Josh, move! What are you doing, man? I got a bad feeling about this. Well, this is terrible. I hate the sound of this. Uh, okay. I need some help. Brendan! I need some help finding a spot, brother. I need your help. <laughs> okay. I'll help. We're gonna be methodical about this, just as methodical as Jamie. Everyone here is a veteran hider. I am a newbie at this. I don't know where I'm gonna go, again. We're gonna find somewhere that's comfortable this time, because I could be there for like three hours. I did some scouting before. I know exactly where to hide. Where are you going, Xander? I got a spot, I need you to help me. We're really slim pickings for spots here. Brendan? They say the definition of crazy okay. is trying the same thing twice and expecting different results. Well, call me Looney Tunes because we're going back to the roof. I want to just like go in these boxes. This is going to be pretty uncomfortable, but uh, I don't think James is going to look back here. He would never look under this desk. Here I go. No. <laughs> what do you think, buddy? Where do you want to go? I think I get squeaky, I think so. Uh, <laughs> don't forget the chicken. <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, I know, I know it's dark. Another wonderful bit of strategy about this roof. He ain't gonna hear this up here. He's gonna be listening to the ones down there. So last time I had a pretty good spot in the warehouse and the only reason I got found was because I had to move. This time, I don't think there's any movement happening. So I'm gonna try it again. I am literally in the same spot that I was in the first hide and seek because in this weather, Jamie is not gonna come up here. <laughs> I've closed myself in. I'm in position, comfy, I got my little pig. Can you see me? Not really. Okay, thank you, bye. I'm just gonna hang out, cross my fingers. Their five minutes is up. Time for me to start hunting. I have never won this game yet. So I've taken things into my own hands. Number one, the best player, Joey, is on camera now, okay? I've taken the best player out to give myself a chance to win. Is it fair? No, but, but I'm the boss. I get to make the rules, so let's do this. I also cut the number of players down from seven to six, okay? Everyone has to make noise every once in a while. It's gonna be a slam dunk, Joey. I'm so excited. I'm gonna let's find everyone so fast. I'm excited. I think we do the normal thing. We yeah. start at the front of the building and work our way to the back. One of these days, somebody's gonna hide in that thing, right? Not today. I don't know if anybody's in here. We're just gonna have to bust in on this locked door here. Oh, ah! oh gosh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> Got him! These two have moved offices for the day, I guess. They're not hiding. Got a whiteboard of strategy for hide and seek? Let me show you what I've done. <laughs> This is the dictator episode, uh, right? Yeah. We gotta get out of here. We gotta go find all these people. Bye. This is empty. If someone's <laughs> hiding in here, you're doing a great job. Okay, I don't think anyone's in here. Gotta check the big box. Nope. It's all right, it's all right. It's a big building, Joey, you know that. Can they hide outside? Oh man, I don't wanna go outside. It's all cold and everything. In the Time that this game is going on, it is supposed to rain one and a half inches and drop 20 degrees down below freezing. I've stacked the deck, so I really. Oh, I was about to say I found one, but he's not playing. No. Nope. <laughs> I think he's in the studio. His voice is pretty loud. I have to win, right? I have to win. What are you gonna say if you do lose, though? We'll cut out all the part about me being a dictator <laughs> and changing all the rules and hope the audience doesn't notice. That's what a dictator would do, right? Boy, I feel like there's good poking sticks in here. 
Oh my gosh, here's a great one, Joey. Wait, no, I think he's going away. Just oh a C-stand arm? Oh my gosh. <laughs> poke, poke, poke. Boy, Studio B's looking clear. Although, I do know someone could be back here. Joey, I feel it, I feel it. Here comes the first person. I'm gonna get my camera out to record it. Oh, you're that confident. Hello? Who's down there? Who's down there? Okay, it turns out uh, no one's down there. No big deal. That's, we just cut it out. We just cut it out. Yeah. We just cut it out. Never happened. Benevolent dictator mode. Shoot! I gotta confess, Joey, the other thing I did, I kind of stacked the deck and we got, I think, three people playing that have never played before. <laughs> I replaced three veterans with, with three newbies. You know what? I'm going back in the studio. I just think somebody's in here. I think Brendan was covering for someone. Is someone in here? You ready? You getting a good shot of this reveal? Three, two, one, there it! Never mind on that. Cut it. Yeah, cut that. Somebody could be under here. Nope. Maybe there's someone under there! Cut it. I still have an ace up my sleeve, Joey. At some point, they're all gonna have to make noises with their plastic animal That's toys. True. I wonder how much time we've got. That's really gonna help me out, I think, a lot. There's two spots I think we should look very carefully at Studio A. Spot number one, the fridge. Found you! Dang it. Okay. <laughs> and then down under here. Found you! Oh, I got one! What? Yes! You found me. I got Josh E! Hi, Jamie. Hi. You just found really fast. First man down. That was quick. Dictator mode, it's working. Get out, it's time for your punishment. Uh, Hold on to that till it shocks I you. I think the anticipation's the worst part. <laughs> and you gotta keep it moving. Really just, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dictator mode, off to a great start. Let's get into that warehouse, Joey. I just found Josh, and that saved my butt, because it means he's probably not gonna come back in Studio A. So I think I'm good. Anybody in there? I don't want to hurt you, but I will. Who's in here? Nobody. Okay. We know this room is clear. Let's go upstairs. All right, come on, come Can on. We'll keep this pace. We're gonna be done by lunch. I know, especially when those animals start going off. Oh no, it's almost time to squeeze the chicken. We're all gonna do it together. And Jamie hasn't been in the warehouse yet, so I'm feeling pretty confident. He's anywhere near me the next time that happens. I might be toast. I don't think he's been around the studio in a while, so I don't think he heard mine. Nobody was found after the first squeeze. I swear Jamie gets worse at this game every episode. I think this room is clear. Is everybody like in the warehouse? What about this room? You know, are they under desks? I want those noises to go off though. No one. That room is clear. Is there anyone? Back here. Hello, good morning. Hello, hello. I haven't found enough people yet. All right, dude, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh man, it's cold up on that roof. You think anybody's up there? We'll leave that for later. If somebody's up there, they'll just be miserable for a little longer. Yeah, they're miserable. Let's check Emily and Daly's office. Oh, they're going in our office. Daly's sick and Emily is hiding. Okay, it's just the dude. I found someone, but it's just the dude. Is someone underneath this pile of stuff right here? Nope. Dang it. It's almost time to squeeze the chicken. It's in my office. <sighs> Joey, we've searched a lot of the building. We've only found one person. <laughs> what is happening? Anybody up, up top? Anybody down here? All right, it's pig squeeze time. Here we go. <laughs> Meanwhile, Joey, I'm not seeing anything. I'm really not. Oh man. What the H? <laughs> they gotta all be in the warehouse. They've gotta be. That's the only explanation. There are so many spots in here, it seems impossible. I know. I'm kinda worried, because the next peg squeeze is in 10 minutes. Hopefully he's out of the warehouse by then. Come on, come on. What about behind the boxes? Seems promising. 
I'm feeling it. You're feeling it? I'm feeling it behind this one. It's further out than the other ones because I think they're just standing right back there. Here we go. Uh, Got him! Uh, gotcha. It's time for your punishment. Okay, shake it a little bit. Ooh. Oh, yeah, hold on uh, to that. Yeah, is it getting you? Yes, multiple times. How long do I gotta hold this? Uh, I don't know, for a while. <laughs> hold on to Joshua, like this isn't that. fair. <laughs> <laughs> it's so beautiful when you call it and it happens. The newbies are dropping like flies. Now, is there anybody else? My time may have come. Could there be anybody inside of here? Nope. Let's take a look up these stairs. Not seeing much, dude. Okay. Maybe we gotta go old warehouse? That's been a hot spot recently. Ready or not, here I come. He just walked to the old warehouse. He thinks this is clear. We have two minutes till the next pig squeeze, so I might get away with this. I gotta actually get low to look. I'm not seeing anybody. Where are you, folks? You gotta be in here, because I've checked everywhere else. Meanwhile, it's time to squeeze again. Oh, no. I'm surprised we haven't heard the animals. I know. Yeah. Is this building that big, or are we just that far off? Well, we don't know how often it's going off. Come on, people. Show yourselves. Like, where's Andy? Right, where is, where is Andy? And Sandin, where could he be? No one's in there. Do we just go into every room and wait and listen for the sound? That's a strategy. We're, we would eat time, but is it worth it? Man. What the heck? Seriously, dude. What is going on? I don't know where he is. I hear him though, he's so loud. You look stressed. <laughs> Joey, I think we've been to every room in the building. It's such a tough strategy decision. Should I just stay in Studio A and hope, <laughs> but like I wouldn't know when it should have happened. Yeah, what if it just happened and we're in here right. waiting? This is not how this was supposed to go. Maybe there's somebody behind that door. There wasn't. Let's look in this random storage office place. Come on. Wait. Oh, I think I found somebody. I see their animal under there. Oh, oh that's got to be Emily. Yes, that is Emily. I found her. Got one. That is a good hiding spot. Oh, wow. <laughs> How have I not heard that yet? I don't know. That's the crazy part. Are, are they deaf? Are they giving it like? I heard it. You're number three, OK? I'm fine with Zach. I so play she's you... out at you... home with my family. Oh, you like getting shot? Yeah, it's just a thing. Okay, you're, you've been no fun. You've been <laughs> no fun to find. We're halfway there, Joey, halfway there. If Emily was in that room and she heard it going off, we've got to be close to some other people, right? They're probably like in here with us. I'm probably sitting on top of Andy right now. <laughs> I just don't even know it. I do want to hear a honk. I know. Meanwhile. All right, you know what time it is. Time for another squeeze. Praying I don't get found. I didn't hear Jamie, so. There's no way he didn't hear that. That reverberated throughout the entire studio. Guess I'm safe. Where are they? This is a travesty. I don't even know where to look anymore. Oh my gosh, it is dreary. Quick, I'm just gonna look into people's cars and see if they're just sitting inside their car, you know? You know, they're in a lot of time. I think I hear Jamie yelling out here, but I don't think it's on the roof. No one's in their car, nothing. I don't think anyone's out here. I mean, I don't think anybody would wanna be outside. You wouldn't wanna be in there. I guess if you're in there, you win. Is anybody on the roof? It would help me out greatly if you would just respond yes or no. So this whole time we could have missed honks that were going on inside. We gotta go look on the roof. Okay, I'm going up on the roof with no jacket. Might wake me up, get the blood really flowing, okay? Everyone in the chat is saying that he's coming to the roof. Fine, fine, fine. We're on the roof, it's cold. I don't see anybody being up here. I just don't think they've done it. Oh my gosh! No! No! <laughs> he came no! back here! Dang it! No! <laughs> I didn't want to come up here. Come I didn't want to come up here either. <laughs> I thought this was the boom. I can't feel my extremities, so I don't know if you'll get a reaction. My dumb <laughs> forgot gloves. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
I think it's... Oh, I think it's shocking me, <laughs> but I can't feel my hands, Jamie. I'm sorry. You might need to get downstairs then. Yeah. I'm feeling better. We're up to four. It's gotta be warehouse, right? But if Emily heard it, it had to have been near there. Cause she couldn't have heard Andy on the roof. I mean, maybe she heard Josh from the studio. I still haven't heard a honk yet. Meanwhile. All right, we gotta squeeze. He's close by, so hopefully I don't get caught this time. Here goes nothing. I don't know if he heard that. Really? Really? I haven't looked behind any of this stuff. Okay. Nope. Not hearing it. I'm just wondering if there's like a desk or something I haven't looked underneath. I don't know, my gut's saying warehouse, but I don't know. Oh my gosh, Joey, we're down to 10 minutes. I mean, this area, dude, we really checked it. Now, the only thing I could think is if somebody like climbed up and is on top of some boxes up there. Come on, baby. Nothing, Joey. Zilch. Dang it. Nada. But I feel good that I looked. They gotta be in this warehouse, right? But where? I've looked in all the usual places, and I'm just not seeing it. He just walked inside right past me. They just breeze it on by. Still haven't heard a single honk. Wonder how many times they've done it. We're down to five minutes, dude. Not looking good. It's not, lo it's not looking fantastic. I might have this one in the bag. I think he thinks the warehouse is clear. It's probably gotta be some things that are just so obvious. I hear him. Is somebody in this again? No, I don't think so. Someone underneath here? Oh, there's a person back there at the wire! Is that Sandin? No. Is that Brayden? Yeah. Oh, it's Brayden back there, okay! Oh! Five out of six, okay, let's go, baby, let's go! All right, all right. Oh, this is the worst. Ow! Oh, my God, it just pulses, oh my God! Okay, you can take it back now. Oh! Oh man, we're down to 30 seconds, dude. Oh. Sandin, where are you? Ah! Oh my gosh. He must have gotten a killer spot. Oh, it's up. Time's up. Time's up. I'm just gonna squeeze this guy until Jamie finds me. <sighs> Sounds like there's a hog loose in the warehouse. He just oh. gave us a hint. After I found Xander, I thought the warehouse was clear. Wait, 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 I just, I just heard something down there. No! I was right here before. No, he's behind all these tiny baking kits. Is that where he is? No! <laughs> no! I, we walked up these stairs right here and I looked around and I'm like, it's all clear. No one's here. Oh, no! <sighs> hey, baby. Oh, you totally <laughs> got me, dude. Oh my gosh. Sweet, sweet victory. Oh. My coworker. Oh gosh. Oh, it's all. Oh. Yep, yep. No, it's it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Okay. All right. I think we're good. All right. Bye. See you next time. Bye. That19.com.